This nice footage shows Estonians and soldiers of the 3rd SS Totenkopf Division during a break in the fighting in early 1944. At the time, there were about 14,000 Estonian soldiers under German control. Here again is the periodical Die Wehrmacht Ausgabe A from January 12th of 1944. If you haven't seen part 1 through 4, I suggest you go back and watch them. The Estonian soldiers had been fighting in a number of formations which included the 5th SS Panzer Division Viking and the Estonian 3rd SS Volunteer Brigade. On January 24th, the brigade was expanded to become the 20th Estonian SS Volunteer Division, which was under the command of Franz Augsberger. With the Soviets advancing quickly west and approaching the Estonian border, at the end of 1943, conscription and mobilization was declared by the German authorities. As a result, 30,000 men volunteered and 8,000 were conscripted. The Estonian authorities supported the mobilization under the naive belief that having Estonians under arms when the Soviets took over would be somehow beneficial. Estonian farmers bring their horses to designated collection points to hand them over to the military. The introduction of military training to the new recruits An Estonian swearing-in ceremony for soldiers of the SS Volunteer Battalion Narva and a Luftwaffe unit. Using tree trunks, these Estonian SS volunteers have managed to cross a trench. To the right, heavy mortar teams are connected by an extensive trench system. The radio operator receives coordinates from a forward observer, which he passes on to a mortar crew that is homing in on the enemy. This is more combat footage from 1944 showing Estonian soldiers in action. If you like the way I combine primary source materials to produce these videos, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. If you are already a Patreon channel member, there you can now see more related material that can't be shown here. If you're not yet a member, please consider becoming one. You won't be disappointed, I promise.
Two Estonian soldiers help a wounded comrade back to friendly lines. To the left is a gun crew placing branches and grass around their light anti-tank gun to camouflage the position. This, I believe, is a captured 45mm Soviet anti-tank gun. The crew is trying to understand how to operate it. This film clip is from a collection that has a total runtime of 10 minutes and 58 seconds. Above, Estonian SS men are clearing trees from rows that Soviet partisans have blocked them with. Below is an MG position in the woods. A soldier takes advantage of a lull in the fighting to sleep. Finally, we come to the end of this periodical and see this nice color photo that seems to be an old brass shell casing that is being used as an alarm. If you're interested in buying this nice collection of periodicals, take a look at the description of this video. Other original collections are also available. Thanks for watching.